Let's have some fun chemistry is sick. I hope you learn more about Vesper theory. Let's have some fun chemistry is sick. I hope you learn more about Vesper theory. With Vesper theory. It helps us determine the molecular shape. And recognize the poor lone pairs for sake. I'm sure if you were a lone pair, you would want to be. Notice, notice, notice. Vesper stands for valence shell electron pair repulsion. It sounds complicated and too much, but it's really not, really not. Think of A as a central atom, X as the attached atoms, and E as the lone pairs around the central atom. Linear is always 180 degrees. Trigonal printer can be two shapes, and they're all 120 degrees. The first is trigonal planar. The second is bent. Tetrahedral can come in three shapes, and they're all 109.5 degrees. The first is tetrahedral, the second is trigonal, pyramidal, and the third is bent. Keep in mind that the lone pairs change the shape. Trigonal by pyramidals can be in four shapes. This is where things get a little tricky. The first is trigonal bipyramidal with 90 degrees and 120 degrees. The second is seesaw. It is also 90 degrees and 120 degrees. The third is T-shaped with 90 degrees. And the last is linear with 180 degrees. But wait, let's not. Forget about octahedral. Octahedral can come in three shapes and guess what? They all come in 90 degrees. The first is octahedral. The second is square pyramidal. The third is square planar. We had some fun. Chemistry is sick. Now you know all about Vesper theory. We had some fun. Chemistry is sick. Now you know all about Vesper theory.